problem.
Excuse me, my sources indicate you were in a warehouse recently. Did you by any chance forward a questionable shipping note to a Mr. Thax? It looks suspicious, so I passed it on. I'm a representative for Mr. Thax. He's very grateful to you. Please accept this as a gift for bringing the shipping irregularities to his attention. It was my pleasure. Have a pleasant day. I have a message for Miss Lawson. Lantea has reserved a room at Eternity and will be waiting. Thank you, Edie. Hungry? Then come to the Fish Dog Food Shack. Tasty fare and skewers are just five credits. You have to give the Asari credit. Ilium is a cultural marvel. Humanity can learn a lot from their ingenuity. No, you don't understand! I lost it somewhere near the transport terminal. It can't be replaced! It... Pardon me, I'm on a call. How can you short sell on prefabs after these human colony attacks? They're going to see a ton of business. A ton of immediate charity. Do you have anything flashier? I want something that says, I own this room. I can't believe how lovely your scalp looks. Mine is so gangly and asymmetrical. You want to know what's going on? Really give them a call. The prison ship no, Purgatory has been destroyed no, following an apparent not. riot. Security ships are en route to the area to retrieve prisoners and guards from life pods. See why we're here. Salarians do not get married. My family simply negotiated a reproduction contract. Whatever. It's the closest you guys get to a wedding, and that means you get a bachelor party. End of story. I don't understand. Humans celebrate wedding contracts by tempting infidelity? That makes no sense. Calm down, man. Don't embarrass me in front of the stripper. What do Turians do? Do Turians do this too? I'm just here for the drinks. You said that bachelor parties are for very close friends. We're just co-workers. We've been co-workers for five years, though. Aren't Solarian years like dog years? Okay, now that's offensive. I appreciate the gesture, but my people don't even have sex drives the way humans do. Uh-huh. Take a look at that, man. Everybody likes the Asari. Everybody. But we actually reproduce by... My word. She is very... Limber. I can appreciate her dancing in an aesthetic manner, but I don't have feelings of... She is a lovely shade of blue. Okay, that makes my legs hurt just watching it, and my knees are meant to bend that way. This isn't as bad as I'd feared. It's actually... Is it warm in here? Okay, you see that bit there? The little divot in her abdomen? It's called a belly button. Humans and Asari have them, and you're gonna be doing shots out of it later tonight. That can't be sanitary. Not the point, man. I can understand why I might find Asari attractive, but how can they be attractive to humans, too? They look just like Salarians. What? They look exactly like us. I'm... I, I'm not seeing the Salarian thing at all. At all. You're both wrong. Asari look just like Blue Turians. Look at the head fringe. Wait, you don't think they're, like, mind-controlling us to see them as attractive, do you? Please be quiet. You're going to ruin Asari for me. And there aren't many Turian women on Ilium. Well, I suppose watching just one more dance wouldn't hurt. Ha <laughs> ha that's the spirit! As long as I'm not paying for the drinks. I still don't see why we're here. Salarians do not get mad. Ms. Lawson, I'm glad you've made it. We've had a complication. What happened? Is Ariana all right? She's fine, but you listed a man named Niket as your trusted source. 
He contacted me, warning that your father has sent Eclipse mercenaries to make a sweep. He suggested that the mercs might be watching for you personally. He's offered to escort Oriana's family to the terminal instead. You didn't mention anything about Niket. He's a friend. He and I go back a, a long way. Do you want to bring in any of your other Ilium contacts, Ms. Lawson? No. You and Niket are the only two I trust on this. What information do you have about the mercenaries? I've confirmed that they're Eclipse, and that they're working for an organization Ms. Lawson warned us about. I could try to alert the authorities, but so far they've done nothing illegal. You made the right decision. We'll handle this ourselves. Making changes now could be dangerous. Are you sure you can trust Niket? Absolutely. He's one of my oldest friends. I trust him with Ariana. Lantea, we'll follow Niket's suggestion. Shepard and I will take the car and draw their attention. Have Niket escort the family to the shuttle. Give him full access to the family's itinerary, just to be safe. Understood, Ms. Lawson. So the plan is for us to get shot down by Eclipse while your sister gets to safety? Eclipse will be under orders to take my sister alive. They won't risk anything that could kill us. I doubt Eclipse will send all their people just to stop you. Do you want to give Niket any backup? Niket can take care of himself. Besides, any armed backup just draws attention to him. I'm ready whenever you are, Miranda. Thank you, Shepard. I appreciate this. I hadn't planned on Eclipse, but they never planned on you. Eclipse mercenary gunships. They'll be dropping troops in the cargo areas. Put us down in that cover behind them. Let's hope they really do want to take us alive. Hold fire! I said hold fire, damn it! I got this. Since you're not firing yet, I trust you know who I am. Yeah, they said you'd be in the car. You're the bitch that kidnapped our boss's little girl. Kidnapped? This doesn't involve you. I suggest you take your men and go. Think you've got it all lined up, huh? Captain Inyala's already moving in on the kid. She knows about Niket. He won't be helping you. What do you mean, Niket won't be helping us? Nothing you need to worry about. Nobody's gonna get killed unless you do something stupid. You walk away now, the girl goes back to her father, and everybody's happy. Everybody but my sister. And me. Should we be talking to Captain Inyala about this? You don't want to talk to the Captain. She's not as... polite as I am. She's the best commando I've ever seen. I've seen her tear people in half with her biotics. And she's getting paid a lot to stop you. She gets in my way, she'll never have a chance to spend it. Wait, Miranda, you said she was your twin sister. That what she told you? No, this crazy bitch kidnapped our boss's baby daughter. He's been looking for her for more than a decade. It's complicated, Shepard. We share the same DNA, just not the same birthday. You took a baby from the richest guy in the galaxy, lady. I don't know what your damage is, but you're not getting away with it. I'm giving you one chance to leave. That's more than most get. 
Captain Inyala ordered us to give you one chance to walk away. This whole time we've been talking, my men have been lining up shots. When I say the word, we unleash hell on your squad. So I suggest you walk away nicely, unless you want to... Hang on, I've got one of their radios. I'll patch us in, see if I can get an idea of what we're up against. Shepard, I think I owe you an explanation. Ariana is my twin, genetically. But my father grew her when I was a teenager. She was meant to replace me. I couldn't let my father do to her what he did to me. So I rescued her. She's almost a woman now. Sounds like your friend Niket might be in some trouble. If they've got to Niket somehow, this is going to be harder than I'd planned. According to the specs I reviewed, we'll need to cut through the cargo processing yard to get to Oriana. I hope your friend can be trusted. Absolutely. Niket is one of my oldest friends. I guess you could say he was my only real friend. He's the only person I didn't cut ties with when I left my father. Is there a chance your father could be using Niket to get to you? I'm sure he's tried, but Niket's one of the few people who understands what my father is really like. I trusted him with my life when I ran from my father, Shepard. He won't betray me now. Let's go find Niket and Oriana. Right. useful. Make activity. 
ready. This should come in handy. <sighs>
Eclipse operatives have attempted to delay you by disabling the elevators. Watch for the drones! Watch the Take fire! Care. No! no. Maybe the captain knows we're listening in, and she's feeding misinformation about Niket making a switch. Or maybe it means something else. Niket wouldn't do that. Damn it, why won't this thing go any faster? The message on the radio seemed pretty clear. He wouldn't betray me. We'll be at the transport shuttle in a moment, and we'll clear this up. Listen to me. I've got authorization to change their booking. I'm sorry, sir. We're under security lockdown. Until the situation in the cargo terminal is resolved, no passengers can be rebooked. This isn't worth my time, Niket. I get paid regardless of how the girl gets there. No. I was told that I could handle this my way. We're not traumatizing the family any more than we... This should be fun. <laughs> Niket, you sold me out. Not many civilians around. We can end this here and now. Not before I get some answers. Why, Niket? You were my friend. You helped me get away from my father. Yes, because you wanted to leave. That was your choice. But if I'd known that you'd stolen a baby... I didn't steal her. I rescued her. From a life of wealth and happiness? You weren't saving her. You were getting back at your father. How did Miranda's father turn you? They told me you kidnapped your baby sister all those years ago. They said I could help get her back peacefully. No trauma to the family. I told them you'd never do that. They could go to hell. Then you finally told me what you'd done. I called them back that night. Why didn't you call me, Niket? We've been through a lot. You could have at least let me explain. I deserve to know that you'd stolen your sister, Miri. I deserve to know you were with Cerberus. But I had to hear it from your father first. How much did Miranda's father pay you? A great deal. Damn it, Niket! You were the only one I trusted from that life. He knew you felt that way. That's why he bought me. So you just took his money? Don't get holy with me, Miri. You took his money for years. If Niket knows about Oriana, then your father does too. Relocating her won't work. Miranda's father has no information about Oriana. I knew you had spy programs in your father's system, Miri, so I kept it private. I'm the only one who knows. Which means that you're the only loose end. This isn't how I wanted it to end, Niket. Miranda, wait. You don't want to do this. This has to end here, Shepard. My father will keep trying to find Ariana. Maybe Niket can help. Talk to your father. Just say you got here first. Oh, I'll tell him that you hit her. That I don't know where she is. I never want to see you again, Niket. Done. Now, if you don't mind, I have a shipment to deliver. You'll die for that, bitch!
They've seen us. near the shuttle. I want to make sure Oriana and her family get on safely. Quiet, just how I like it. I can't believe Niket sold me out. I didn't even see it coming. Everyone makes mistakes. I'm guessing that's one you won't repeat. Why didn't you let me kill him? I could have handled that. But watching him get gunned down by that Asari bitch... I know it hurts that he's gone. But at least you don't have his death on your conscience. No. I blame my father for that. Even now he's finding ways to screw with my life. It's always been like this. My father gave me anything I ever wanted. But there was always a hook, an angle for his long-term plan. I threw away everything he ever gave me when I ran. Except Niket on my part let's get moving right No sign of Eclipse. It looks like we're clear. There she is. She's safe. With her family. Come on, we should go. Don't you even want to say hello? It's not about what I want, it's about what's right for her. The less she knows about me, the better. She's got a family. A life. I'll just complicate that for her. She doesn't need any details, but would it really be so bad for her to know she has a sister who loves her? I guess not. Go on. We'll wait here.
Jack and Miranda are in the middle of a disagreement. Can you head it off before they tear out a bulkhead? I'll deal with it. Take pictures. Touch me and I will smear the walls with you, bitch! Enough. Stand down, both of you. The cheerleader won't admit what Cerberus did to me was wrong. It wasn't Cerberus. Not really. But clearly you were a mistake. Screw you! You've got no idea what they put me through. Maybe it's time I showed you. My opinion is the one that matters. You two, keep a deck apart at all times. She can't be trusted, Shepard. She'll jeopardize the whole mission. If we survive this, you two can tear each other apart. Until then, save your hate for the Collectors. She'll survive. I'll make sure of it. Then, I'll tear you apart myself. You two gonna be okay? It's a good thing you came by when you did. As long as she does her job, we'll be fine. Thanks, Shepard. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. 